and gentlemen, welcome to SmackDown. Coming to you tonight from Charlotte, North Carolina. Deep in the hall of wrestling function pool. This crowd is fired up, and I'll tell you what, so am I. An enthusiastic crowd of the greatest superstars in sports entertainment. You can't ask for more than that. Man, you talk about superstars and we ain't got an ounce of quit in them, huh? You're looking at them right here. And that's a potentially dangerous mindset to be in. If you're too proud to realize that you're in trouble, you might wind up risking your career for a single match. Look, this ain't ballet. You gotta go in there every single match and be willing to do whatever it takes. You'd know that if you actually stepped in between the ropes. I don't have to have been in a match to realize that jeopardizing my future for the sake of one match is incredibly short-sighted. Cole, I swear, I'm gonna replace you with someone who actually knows what they're talking about. Maybe Carlito. He might be a little tough to understand sometimes, but at least he knows what it's like to wrestle a match. What a reversal! I don't think there's a superstar in the history of WWE who's gone from rookie to WWE champion as quickly as John Cena has. Yeah, Cole, but you said it yourself. John Cena has shot up real quick. He ain't picked up the experience that a lot of other superstars have, and that could be a little bit of a problem for him. The adrenaline is pumping. The crowd is coming alive. This is what they came to see. Hey, Cole, you know what? Try to restrain yourself a little bit, okay? You're supposed to be calling this bad boy right down the middle. Wow, great reversal. And the crowd has come alive tonight with a chant directed at the superstars in the ring. Yeah, you can't let that break your focus. That's easier said than done. Oh, God. I think every guy watching this knows how painful this has got to be. Oh, except you. I know I do. And in times like these, I'm glad to stay on this side of the announce table. Rey Mysterio is so exciting to watch in action. He's so fast, so agile, so talented. I really think he could be a serious contender for the WWE title. you got to be kidding me, Cole. I mean, yeah. Mysterio's extremely fun to watch it all, but how is a guy his size going to win a WWE title? Get real. Come on, Taz. You of all people should know that size isn't everything. You're a professional WWE champion, aren't you? You damn skippy hippie. I, I sure am, but you know what? It's not about me. It's about Rey Mysterio. And between Rey and myself, we were two different types of animals. And by the way, Cole, just because I'm not seven feet tall don't mean I can't kick your ass. Trust me. Oh, my. Talk about your compromising positions. Nothing will take the fight out of a superstar quicker than a move like this. It sounds... And there's the counter, Cole. Taz, in your entire career, have you ever seen a superstar as loved by the fans as Rob Van Dam? No, I've never had. I mean, every crowd that Van Dam performs in front of loves this guy to death. Loses this fight, it's gonna have a long fall in their immediate future. Watch it, he reversed it. No, I don't. Oh my god, this could be the end of the match. Can he reach it? Man, is a point. You're up and knocks you down from there, you might as well throw him the out. He's going for it. This will be over right now. What a counter that was. He slipped out of that one. Ladies and gentlemen, we are seeing an incredible display of athletic ability here tonight. What do you expect? If he can grab that briefcase, he gets the contract. Hey, the ref's got a tough job. I mean, trying to keep these superstars on the up and up, that's hard. Well, it's easier to get some superstars to play by the rules than others. And you know what? Wow, look at him up there, trading shots back and forth. These competitors are going to trade blows until someone falls off the ladder. He anticipated that move perfectly. This capacity crowd is making their opinions known tonight. No surprise there, Paul. The WWE fan ain't exactly known for keeping their opinions to themselves. Great match. 
match so far, but I think it's pretty obvious which way it's going. Oh, really? Are you willing to go out on a limb and actually make a guess then? There's no guesswork involved, Cole. But if you're gonna be snippy, I'm just gonna keep my mouth shut. Wow, if I knew it was that easy, I would have said that years ago. Oh, look at that. He's pleading like a stuck pig. I can't tell if that's a cut or a broken nose, but either way, the referee might need to stop this fight. The ref's not gonna stop the match, Cole. It's just a little blood. Come on, be a man, will you? There's ever been a more dominant superstar in WWE than the legendary dead man, The Undertaker. Yeah, you can only stay on top of the mountain for so long, and the dead man's been there for. These superstars are beating the hell out of each other 15 feet in the air. Both of these superstars are determined to stay out of the ladder. Watching these superstars go at it reminds me why I prefer to stay on this side of the announce table. Oh, come on, Paul. You know, you should let me train you. You could be Cruiserweight champ in like a year. Oh, no. I've heard stories about the way you train people. You make Marines real instructors look like pushovers. Duh. They're just training people to go to war. I'm training to be WWE Superstar. Well, thanks but no thanks, partner. I think I'll stick to announcing for now. I love hearing the crowd come alive, even when I don't exactly agree with what they're saying. Me too, and I do agree with what they're saying, Taz. Victory may be within reach right here. Oh! You want this seat? Come on, ref. That should have been a disqualification right there. Should have, would have, could have, Cole, but it's not. It's not a disqualification. I have never seen two competitors more determined to beat the living hell out of each other. These superstars give everything they got when they're in a match like this. But a lot of people don't realize what they sacrifice behind the scenes also. No question. If you want to make this not an ounce of quitting either one of these superstars, but someone's going down. I'll tell you what, right now, Cole, there's not enough room up there for both of them. Man, you just can't put anything over on these fans. You sure can. They see everything, and they'll let you know about it. <sighs> Rey Mysterio never fails to impress the tank. Oh, my God! There it comes! The pedigree. He's looking to put his opponent away right here. This is one heck of a match so far. It sure is, Taz. What do you think the highlight has been so far? Oh, boy. That tussle buckle is not where you want to be at this point in the match. Especially when your opponent is raining down those close fist blows on you. He's got his opponent in the turnbuckle. And here comes the punches. This is very educational. He's teaching the crowd to count to ten. The battle looks like some of them. Ah, they can use that. And this could be the Money in the Bank match right here. calls himself the whole damn show, and that just gives you an idea, just a little sample, of how big this guy's ego is. I think he should focus his energy on winning matches and titles instead of promoting himself all the time. If RBD's got a big ego, it's because he's earned it. As a former ECW superstar yourself, you should know what an impressive career he's had so far. Superstars successfully executes their finishing move. This one is over. Neither one of these superstars wants to be the one to fall off the ladder. Only one of these superstars is gonna hold on. But who's it gonna be? <laughs> wow, listen to that chant, Taz. I'll tell you what, if you've got the crowd on your side or against you, it makes a huge difference, believe me. Ah! These WWE fans just can't get enough. Neither one of these guys can afford to get knocked off that ladder. It's a long fall for whoever loses this fight, Cole. 
Here's your win. 